The Rainbird 5000 series of rotors are some of our most popular. In this video, we're going to talk about the Rainbird 5004 PC Sealomatic rotor, tell you what a Sealomatic does, talk about the other features as well, and show you how to change out a nozzle and make some adjustments. I'm Dwayne Smith, your Sprinkler Warehouse product specialist. Let's get started. This is the 5004 PC SAM Sealomatic rotor. Rainbird rotors with SAM in the name have a sealomatic check valve which prevents low head drainage. If there's a significant elevation difference within a zone, once the sprinkler shut off, the lowest head often drains the water out of the piping within the zone, which results in puddling and erosion. The sealomatic check valve on the 5004 holds up to 7 feet of elevation change. The PC in the name stands for partial circle. That means you can adjust the arc, also called the pattern. You can adjust the pattern on this rotor from 40 to 360 degrees. The pop-up height on this rotor is 4 inches and it has a 3 quarter inch inlet. The 5004 rotors have watering distance of 25 to 50 feet depending on which nozzle is installed and how the adjustment screw is set. 5000 series have what Rainbird calls rain curtain nozzles. This rotor comes with this set of rain curtain nozzles. These nozzles have very even spray over their entire distance and larger water droplets. Larger water droplets means less water gets carried away by the wind and more water ends up at your plant roots. The 5000 series of rotors have superb longevity. Rainbird rotors have the longest operating life cycle of any rotor on the market. To adjust the rotor, you can use a Rainbird tool just like this one, or you can use a small flathead screwdriver. Looking at the top of the rotor, this is the radius adjustment slot, this little raised area. That's where you adjust your watering distance. It also has a screw in it that holds the nozzle in place. This is the pull-up slot. You'll need a Rainbird tool like this one to use that. And this is the arc adjustment socket. That affects your pattern. Let's go outside and check out these adjustments. We'll begin by changing out a nozzle. Insert the Rainbird tool in the pull-up slot, twist, and pull up. I'm using a hold-up nozzle install collar to hold the riser to make it easier to work on. But if you don't have one, you can hold it up with your hand. Back out the radius adjustment screw. Pry out the nozzle with the Rainbird tool or a small flathead screwdriver. Insert the new nozzle. The divot that accepts the radius adjustment screw goes up and thread back down the radius adjustment screw. Turn on the water to your system and use the radius adjustment screw to set the watering distance. You want the water from this head to reach the next head over. To adjust your arc, also called the pattern, Insert the Rainbird tool or a small flathead screwdriver in the adjustment socket and turn it clockwise to increase the arc or counterclockwise to decrease. You're going to love working with the 5004 PCs. They'll give you year after year of solid performance. Buy yours today on sprinklerwarehouse.com. Remember, Sprinkler Warehouse has everything you need to make your trees, lawn, flower beds, and gardens lush and beautiful. Questions? Chat with one of our incredible customer service agents on sprinklerwarehouse.com. They really do know their stuff and they'll get you squared away. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for helpful tips, tutorials, and general sprinkler instruction. Sprinkler Warehouse, America's most shop sprinkler store.